Just tell me, Mum, how long? Um, another 30 or 40 years, God willing. <laughs> um, it appears I don't have cancer after all, Stace. What? I, I, don't, I don't understand, Martin said. Uh, after I found the lump, I, I thought, well, I can't go through treatment again. The sickness, the toll, well, you know, not again. So, I thought, I'm gonna die. I'll do it on my terms. So I left it to fate. And it appears that fate has given me a second chance. <laughs> Anyway, enough about me. What about you? I want to know everything. It's been awful not being able to visit you now. How have you been managing? Are you still friends with that woman, Eve, is it? Mm, don't worry about me. Anyway, so how did it end up with the police? Well, I've been charged. Just have to wait and see. I don't mind. I did do it. Ruby has pleaded guilty. Oh, she's done that to get a shorter sentence. She knows how the system works, Mum. Hmm. I was hoping it was her sense of karma that made her do it. As long as she stays out of our lives, I do not care. I feel a bit sorry for Martin, though. No, I don't. We tried to warn him. He's made his posh bed with his Egyptian sheets so he can lay in it. You did love her, you know, Stacey. And you know how easy it is to be blinded by love. Mm. Well, I've been going mad in here, not being able to see you. And to think you've gone through all that on your own. You thought you were going to die and then you found out you're not. Well, I wasn't completely on my own. Daniel was with me. <laughs> in here. <laughs> in here. <laughs> when things got really quite frightening, I just thought, well, I might get to see him again. <laughs> I know. <laughs> Still might, though, one day. I've got so much to be grateful for, Stace. I have got my health. I have got you, I have got Sean. Do you know, I think I might be the luckiest person I know. Yeah? Mm. Well, I hope that luck lasts, cos when Ruby gets out, she'll be gunning for you. Oh, she can do what she likes. When you've stared death in the face twice, nothing's